I'm back to do a reading for Libra. You can have Libra anywhere in your chart. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node. I want to say thank you to all my subscribers, all my new subscribers. Welcome. If you haven't already hit that bell button, hit that bell button at the bottom so you can get a notification each time I upload. Thank you, Holy Spirit. First card out is this bear. A fourth person under the bottom. Wow. Okay. Courtship. So someone is in a lot of regret at this time, son. See, this person is going through a lot of changes, okay? This person could be not working at this time. It's giving me the five of pentacles. This person could be having health issues, could be have, um, getting eviction orders being put out. Somebody is just in despair. They don't know what the... I heard they don't know what's coming. Wow, I heard they don't know what's coming. So this person could definitely be under judgment at this time, okay? You need a fourth person. Somebody hooked up with a karmic. Somebody got in a relationship with a karmic, okay? A karmic. This was a karmic cycle. Yeah, we have privileged lady, expectation, mature, wow. So somebody was expecting to get something from you. Somebody was expecting for you to help them out. They see you as someone very mature, very loving, very abundant, and they just felt like, oh, well, you know, Mystic Sunflower, Collect the sun seeds will help me balance the situation out what I'm going through. They 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 love it. They 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 got a bag. They help me. Oh, they help me get out this rock courthouse with lovers. Mm. So this is somebody that you definitely pulled your energy back from sun seeds. Okay, you guys could have been married to this person. Or just with this person for a long time. But this is somebody that you definitely pulled your energy back. You could be waiting, you could be, if you have a child with this person, you could be waiting on some type of child support, some type of income from the courthouse. Somebody like, how, I, me help you, you owe me. Sunsteed, I don't know who that's for, that could be for one or two of you guys. You're like, you, you, I'm waiting on your help. You hooked up with a karma, got in this false relationship with this karma, and now you lost everything, and you looking over at me, living this abundant lifestyle, at peace, at ha happy. Bills being paid, I'm doing very well for myself. I may not be the richest, but I don't want for anything. I'm mature because I handle my business. I don't like to be around people who don't handle their business. Ooh, I heard somebody, and that's a, ooh, I just got a burp. That's the spirit, so that's confirmation. Somebody realizes energy is everything. Wealthy man, thoughts. You could be this wealthy man or wealthy woman. You know, there's no gender in tarot. Somebody is in their thoughts about you. Somebody somebody really, somebody thought they had a better option. And they wound up hooking up with a forced person. And this person is expecting for you to help them because they see you as someone very mature. You could be someone very understanding, compassionate, loving, empress energy, emperor energy, take it how it resonates. But somebody sees you as a boss. And they feel like you could you could pull them up at under some damn hard time or some rock they going through. Somebody going through a lot of changes in their life. A lot of you guys could have pulled your energy back from this person who you was um, in a relationship with, you know, to balance things out. Somebody felt like because you didn't because you wasn't giving into this connection anymore, they decided to hook up with a third party, and whoever it was, it was a fourth person. Somebody lost everything. Ooh. Poverty. Wow. Change. Somebody is going through changes in their life. Yeah, because I'm telling you, they hooked up with a D. Yeah. Wow. This person hooked up with a D. Maybe this person thought that by hooking up with this person, this was the next best thing. They thought you was going to be in poverty. Something about you have changed. Okay. Something about you have changed. Maybe this person used to you being, um, you know, gullible, always giving into the situation, always helping this person out. But somebody is not giving in anymore. Somebody realizing that this person was a thief. All they wanted to do was take, 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 and not give into the connection. It was a one-sided relationship. I'm hearing somebody say, nobody running my money. Nobody running my money. I ain't got nothing for them, Mystic. I ain't got nothing for them. Give me a card on the power of the Holy Spirit. Yeah. Concern. 
This person is a concern because they don't have anything. This person could not have nothing to, uh, you know, you know, take care of their children because this is like a little kid. Somebody was real childish. They made childish decisions. They hooked up with snakes and rats and treated you any kind of way. Somebody just thought that you was gonna you was gonna fall. No, actually, you stayed ten toes down. Somebody thought you was gonna fall. Not knowing divine is just only preparing you for the year 2023. And somebody thought they was going a deed, they were gonna steal from you. Something changed. You you coming up as a mature woman, something changed. You've been through a lot. You've been through a lot. Yeah, message of concern and message. Woo. Message and message of concern concern and toy and labor. Somebody is gonna message you how hard things is for them. Maybe this person was up one time. And they, this person could have left you when you was down. This person could have been doing very well for themselves at one time, but now they're not so more. Let me get this card for you guys, son, please. We have bad health. This person is stressed out, dealing with health issues. Bad health. Yeah. Somebody thought something was going to be over for you. Somebody thought they was going to end you. Somebody thought they was going to end you. Somebody can't believe how you have so many blessings coming towards your way. You found out about some secrets and decided to go a different whole way. Somebody decided to go to the light. And now the floodgates is being open for you. Yeah, because you're the fishy person. Mm. Somebody think you a fool, Sunseeds. They really think you a fool. This is somebody that studies you, Okay. Had you in a third party. And now this person is experiencing some type of health issues. This person could have contracted something from this third party. Okay. Yeah, but this is how this person sees you. As a sweetheart. Priestess. A lot of you guys can be in a high priestess. Something about your intuition. You already know. I feel like somebody was trying to sell you a dream. To just try to get on your good side. Give me some more messages, Holy Spirit, for this despair and false person. Somebody going to come back and tell you everything you want to hear under the sun. Yeah, I can't make it up. Despair, false person, caution. I cannot make it up. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Deef. Somebody hooked up with a deef. You have two deef cards out here. Mm. Somebody hooked up with a deef. Somebody hooked up with a deef, lost every goddamn thing, and is looking at you. Okay, and it's abundant energy. And, and have plans on coming, expecting to come to you and take something from you. Spirit, like, uh-uh, look what's under the bottom. Foe. This is a foe. Somebody watch you go on a transformation that brings you great fortune. Ooh, and they was waiting. And signs, they getting tired of waiting. Somebody getting tired of, see that act. That act that they putting on, it's getting hard for them because they got to keep it up. Spirit is exposing them slowly but shortly. They can't take it no more. They're in despair. What a what? Misfortune. Somebody could have lost some. Um, somebody, um, somebody um, could have lost um, they said they for the other. Okay. If this not um, if this wasn't an actual death, somebody could have just lost something. You know, lost a lot. But somebody who they was in a uh, marriage with. I'm also hearing if somebody don't stop playing these games, somebody is going to somebody is going to lose their life. You got sweetheart under the bottom. Yes, if somebody don't stop playing with the sweetheart, it's, it's not going to be nice. What's this misfortune and woo? This is going to be for one or two of you guys. Somebody could have lost their um, could have lost their wife or husband. You know, there's just energy. And somebody could have, um, somebody could have got some type of um, insurance or inheritance, okay? Somebody could have decided to, you know, move on with their life, start dating again, and they wanted to hook it up with a karmic, somebody who was a D, somebody only seen them for what they had. Ooh, somebody could have played on somebody's weakness. That's going to be for one or two of you guys. Yeah, but somebody said sorrow and, sorrow and servant. Because somebody just thought somebody was just going to cater to them, you know, be their servant. 
bring their food, take care of them, buy them clothes, pay all the bills, help them out. It ain't working out for them. Yeah, love. Whoever this love relationship was with. Somebody's going to come back, want to marry you. They want a reunion. They want to go on this journey with you. Somebody's definitely going to marry. Um, well, I heard somebody's definitely going to marry you. So a lot of you guys are going to take this person back for others. This is just a message. Some of the, For some of you guys, this person could have hooked up. Um, young woman, metal lady, lover. For some of you guys, this person could have hooked up with a younger energy. Somebody who was younger than them. And somebody could have um, definitely be, um, contracted something or be dealing with some type of health issues. Somebody hooked up with a, a younger person. Ooh, wow. And joyfulness and sweetheart. Now somebody wants to come back and have a reunion with you. Sweetheart and joyfulness. Like if none of this shit even happened. Oh, wow. Yeah. But with the priestess and forceness, your intuition, your intuition already telling you that this person is not real right. They fake, they phony, they a liar. Okay, merchant. Somebody just only coming back to steal what you have built on. Because they're an enemy. They're an enemy. Service and thoughts. Somebody, whatever you do for work, somebody is constantly and they thoughts about it. How's this person doing so well? How's this person so fortunate? How's they making it? I can't, this is not this person looking. You hear that horn? Confirmation. I can't stand to watch them, but I keep on watching them. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Malachi and pleasure seekers. Yeah, somebody, somebody is regretful about that third party with the hope card. Yeah, somebody is sick, down, depressed, and busted. And cheerfulness, they thought they was going to be happy. But Spirit said, surprise, they got some type of conversation some conversation that they had. They could have experienced some bad news, but something came through. Mm -hmm. Spirit, give me some cards on this bad health. Yeah, bad health with the doctor under the bottom with consistency. This person could have been warned by the this person could have received some type of warnings. Ignore this spirit. Give me a card on the bad health, please, and thank you. Ooh, bad health, Holy Spirit. Please and thank you. Yeah, consolation. Somebody is consulting with a doctor. They could be in a room speaking to a doctor in regards to their health, how to fix it, how to get better. Wow. Somebody could be praying to God for changes. Help me. Oh, somebody is down and out right now. This also for some of you guys can be a friend, someone you considered a friend. If this is not a lover, give me more on the consolation and bad health. Yeah. Melika, somebody is sad. Yeah, and whoever this person is, they're in despair. Because pleasure seekers, some whoever this third party is, oh my goodness. Yeah. That third party, yeah, reunion and death. A lot of you guys say I will not be going back. That is over. And the thought somebody knows that. Oh. Somebody karma was the, this fourth person. Ooh, yeah. I'm hearing for a lot of you guys, you got out just in time. Spirit, give me a card on the poverty and concern, please, and thank you. Poverty and concern is uh, clarified with Scholar. Somebody is looking you up, watching you, trying to study you. How can they come in? How can they strategize to get you to get on their side? How they can how can they get you to help them? But with the soldier card, y'all know this is my ancestor card. Mm -mm, your ancestor said nope. Prison? Your ancestor said nope. You will be in that mental prison. You will be in that mess that you caused. Something is like a ticking time bomb. Something is about to blow up. You see this bomb right here? Something is about to blow the hell up. Somebody ancestors is like, get back. Get back. You will not come near this sweetheart. You will not. You will not. Ooh. Holy Spirit, give me a card on the beef. The beef. Please and thank you, Holy Spirit. Friend. For a lot of you guys, this is a friend of yours. Or this could be somebody that you considered a friend. 
Yeah. Priestess and hope. It could have been a friend that was trying to attack you guys. Okay, that was jealous of um jealous of whatever you do for work, your upgrades, the life that you live. Somebody could have been trying to attack you for a long time. Somebody is now receiving karma. This could have been somebody you definitely put your energy back. I'm picking up on lovers and friends, so you won't, you know it's gonna be different for all you guys. Give me another card on this friend. I heard fall. And we have it right here. Give me another card on this friend. Yeah, room. So with this hope and room, somebody could be in an emergency room or at the hospital. Mm. You could have known this or in the house. Somebody could be in the house sick. Whoever this fourth person is that was an enemy with the servant thought you was going to cater to them. You have lover and love. So this is definitely um, a romantic relationship. Yeah, somebody was up there was going to steal from you. With the merchant and old woman. If you're not this old woman, you could just be, you know, um, someone who's just very wise, okay? Or someone who, who they see. You could be um, someone who they feel is like you got an old soul. Or, um, you know, you don't do too much, you know? You handle your business as a mature person. You don't party a lot. Maybe if you did party a lot, that's not something that you do anymore. You just focused on what you got going on right now, your abundance, your stability. And somebody could have been like, oh, yeah, they don't really. Maybe they don't really know what's going on in the streets. They don't, they don't, they don't, they don't know the, um, the tricks and trades of a fraud. So let me see if I can run over on this person because this older woman or whoever, they don't know. Or this can be an older woman. That's false. But with the um, metal lady, somebody is sick. Somebody is sick. Yeah. Ooh, and they somebody thought they was gonna come back to you. Oh shit. Sorry, son see. Somebody is not somebody health is not doing too well and they trying to have a reunion with you. You know what? Sorry, give me a card on the floor, and D before I move on. Ooh, chair. Gift. Deep with deep and fall was clarified with gift. Somebody want what you got. Somebody want what you got. And it's making them sick. That child faithful and loyal you are, how the most divine favors you. This could have been somebody that wrongfully did you, did you any kind of way. And somebody realizing the only, with this faithfulness, the only loyal one that I had, I mistreated. And now somebody is going through health problems and they feel like, well, damn, the one person that I crossed, the one person that I shut out, I talked about, I lied on, I know this person would have been right here for me. Yeah, joyfulness and money. Somebody just somewhere else drowning in their abundance. So some of you guys with the wetting and the sorrow, somebody is regret marrying this false person. For others of you guys, Spirit is saying this person with the wedding, with the sorrow and waiting, somebody is waiting to bring you some, an offer. Cheerfulness, wife, and misfortune. Ooh. See, somebody, somebody got plans on celebrating with you, make you and their wife so they can steal from you. And with the Lord, the Most High, saying yes. That is true. Yeah, conversations and journey. They're going to talk about how they want to go on this journey with you, how they want things to be right, how they want things to be better. But with the death and the widower, somebody actually could be passing away for whatever health issues that there, that is. Ooh. Let's get some more messages from Spirit. Yeah, clarity of belief. You're going to receive some clarity. Yeah, look at it. Crack the deck on well-deserved reward. You deserve these rewards. And somebody wants to come in and steal from that. Somebody wants you to help them. Somebody know that you have a good, loving heart. Somebody wants you to come back and bring them to life. You know, provide for them. Help them out. Get them back on their feet. After they decided to hook up with a karmic. Yeah, helpless and hopeless. Move. Ooh. This person could be either staying with someone or lost their home, lost their job, not doing too well financially. Holy Spirit, give me some more messages, please, and thank you. Detach. 11 on the top. Divine Detach, this earth angel. Yes. And it, 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 I'm telling you, it was it could have been real hard for you, Sunseeds. 
to realize the truth of the matter when it came to this person. But with the divine, with the 11 on top and detached, you was enlightened about something. Mm. Yeah, believe and succeed under the bottom. Challenging times. You could have overcame some challenging times to get where you at now. A lot of you guys are very creative, ambitious, go-getters. And somebody thought they was going to come in and steal what you co-created with the universe? Spirit said, oh, hell no. I will expose you publicly or privately. But this earth angel will know. Ooh, give me more of the spirit. Don't shock her. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. There's some type of communication that came into you that enlightened you about this whole situation. And something changed. Yeah, nature. A lot of you guys get your downloads in nature. Spirit is definitely communicating with you. Mm. Come through, Holy Spirit. Any more? Any more, Holy Spirit? This is somebody that wants to talk to you, reach out to you. Now this person wants to be in a relationship with you. Why? Because they see you shining. They see you shining. Look how beautiful you are. Spirit says shine. One and nine breaking down to a ten. You completed out a cycle and now you somewhere shining. Shining. Some of you guys spoke up to this person or some of you guys do something uh, with their communication. A lot of you guys have a mean testimony. That needs to be told to others. Mm. Yeah, base chakra. Ooh. <clears throat> Give me more Holy Spirit. Give me more Holy Spirit. Challenging times came back out. Third eye chakra. Yeah. Reach out. Somebody wants to reach out. Somebody wants to reach out. But I feel like you guys are very intuitive. You guys already know this already. You already know what this person tricks and plans is. Because this person sees you shine. This person sees you doing good for yourself. Okay? This person is definitely going to reach out, spirit, and say, and, to, and communicate with you. Okay? This person is used to you helping them, getting them out of situations. But it's something that just, like, spirit is, like, new. Okay? Something about your foundation, how grounded you are with this nature card. Mm. Yeah, I don't, because with this shine and this base chakra, somebody see you shining. They see your stability real right. And they want to reach out for a helping hand. Healing begins. Love. Mm. Somebody from your past want to heal a situation with you. They want to strengthen. They want you to trust them again with the strengthening bonds and trust. Yeah. They, this is somebody that's going to come in and take action towards you. They feel like they don't have anyone. They feel like they lost everything. And the one person that would have stood by me, the, the one person that would have been there for me, I crossed them. I, I hurt them. I cheated on them. Somebody don't have nothing but the dust. It's just nothing but dirt. Somebody have refused to take the necessary steps to work on this connection with you. And now somebody's stuck between a hard rock. This person who wants to come in and want to romance you and love you and all that. Opportunity begins. You got a lot of opportunities ahead of you. I'm hearing infinite abundance. Infinite, abundant, share the love. So you guys can be sharing love with others. Oh, this is what this person, ooh. Somebody wants some of your love. This person looking at things from a different perspective. They're like, no, I want Mystic Sunflower Collective Sunseeds. I want that type of love. Ooh. 
I feel like whoever this, your, this person is, mm -hmm. somebody's in love with you. I, I mean, it, it, it's just obvious. Somebody's in love, master. Spread your wings. Somebody's admired by you. Somebody's in love with you. This could be an older gentleman. Or this person could be older or you could be younger. Or they could be younger, you could be older. It could be definitely an age difference. Somebody fell in love with you. That's going to be for a few of you guys. Give me more Holy Spirit. Opportunity begins. Yeah, teach and move. It's something that you're supposed, you guys are supposed to be doing. You guys could be a teacher or just... um. You guys could be a school teacher, elementary um, school teacher, high school teacher, doesn't matter. Somebody has a connection with children. For you to get these children to sit down and listen to you and be so intrigued with whatever's coming out your mouth, that, that's a blessing. That's a, that's a talent. These kids are just listening and quiet. A lot of you guys have a role to be a teacher with this move and heart on here. It's something about your heart that moves others. You're very pure, very enlightened. Mm, yeah. Yeah, choose your battles and lead. So at this time, I feel like you guys are choosing your battles. Again, seven and four. Break it down to 11. You can be seeing 11, 11. Somebody is very enlightened. And they, they are choosing their battles. And they are leading the pack. Somebody is a leader. Somebody is a leader. Somebody does not believe this person's stories, whatever they're going to come back saying. Somebody feels like this battle right here, I don't want to mess with it. I have to stay focused. I have a leadership role with the divine. I'm held in high honor. I have to be an example for others. Somebody is choosing their battles. And this is not what they want. Somebody sees you as a star. Give me one more Holy Spirit before we jump into the tarot. Crown chakra. Something about your intuition is telling you something. Yeah. A lot of you guys are, are facing your darkest fears and embracing them and finding balance in your life. Okay. And somebody is, ref somebody is refusing to see something. Somebody is refusing to see something. Look at this shit. Look at this. I ain't playing with you, Empress. What did I say earlier? I knew it was you, Empress. Empress and King of Cups. Somebody is in love with you after they done messed all the way up. Somebody done messed up terribly. King of Cups, Ace of Cups. Whew. Some of you guys are moving on to new love. Yeah, lovers and the King of Cups. Some of you guys are going to have a choice. Okay. Between an old person and new love, but somebody is coming in to take action. It's coming. Ooh, King of Wands with the chariot. Very victorious. Very driven. Someone had discipline to move forward from challenging times. Someone is moving wisely. Mm, somebody is shining, shining bright like a. Somebody's a star. Or will be. Or oh, this side, this person sees you. Holy Spirit, give me some more messages. Look what's coming out. Look. Look at this. Temperance. Six of Cups. They watch you. They stalk you. They want this Two of Cups with you. They want this brand new beginning. Two of Pentacles. Five of Wands. After juggling you. Putting you in competition with someone else. The Shrimp Card High Priestess. Mm. You know all the secrets. And they tried their hardest to hold it back from you. Oh my goodness. I ain't... Wow! Wow, Emperor and Empress back to back? Y'all coming out like that? Empress, Empress? Okay, I'm going to leave y'all right there. We have the Tower card. Something is blowing up. The Lovers? Page of Wands? Six of Pentacles? Someone, you... Wow. Someone is coming in. If you was just um, looking forward to um, any news regarding any finances... You're going to get, be getting some good news, okay, when it comes to your finances. For others of you guys, spirit is bringing in someone of your vibration, okay? Someone is of the divine. The tower and the lovers, who? 
You guys have a decision to make. Okay? Nine of Cups with the high friend. Spirit said, you asked for this. Now your wishes is being granted. Okay? It's going to shock you. It's going to come out of nowhere. There's a choice that needs to be made. Eight of Swords with the Moon card. Don't sabotage your spirit is saying. Don't sabotage just because of what you went through in the past. Okay? About finding out about secrets, lies. Ten of Pentacles. Mm. Something is coming in very innocent and pure. Somebody who that's going to accept you and take you for who you are. Yes, again, look at this. Ace of Cups with the Eight of Swords. Do not sabotage this by being in your head, Sunseeds. I'm hearing you somebody that never asked for too much. Just for somebody just to be who they are. Be confident. Be bold. Be strong. Know that know your worth. Know, know what spirit has for you. Okay? This person's coming in is gonna be very passionate about you. Somebody also um, from your past has a lot of passion for you. And somebody tried to hide it. They tried to hide it. Now this person is all in their head. Somebody hurt themselves. Ooh. Somebody doesn't want to imagine you with someone else. They don't. I keep seeing this Ace of Cups. Look at this. This is my third time. There is new love here. After you walked away, Eight of Cups. Ooh, spirit. Spirit, talk to them. You walk away, you walk right into the Most High. The Most High got something beautiful for you. Mm. Whoever this other person is, you broke them down. You broke them down. Queen of Wands, you broke them down. Okay? They never knew somebody so beautiful, so loving, so caring, so compassionate, so abundant, so fruitful. So creative. A go-getter. Put their mind to something and go after that. Eight of Wands. This person wants to hold on to you. Nine of Pentacles. Self-sufficient, independent, hard-working. Anything that you touch turns into gold. Anything attached to you wins. Anything that goes against this earth angel loses. You teach people lessons, whether it's harsh lessons or good lessons. Somebody had a choice. And that choice kicked their ass. Ooh, child. Ooh, child. Look how chosen you are. Two of Wands, the star, King of Pentacles. You make wise, wise, wise decisions. You're somebody who makes wise decisions. The Hermit, Eight of Pentacles. You're not a you not a pull your energy back. You somebody that know how to go in isolation and do, and work on yourself. Now you get a brand new beginning. You are this wounded warrior. Don't worry about what these haters gotta say. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Only thing you need to be worried about how the most divine, the most high, the divine see you. Ace of Swords, spirit. So that's a damn true. King of Cups, Two of Cups. Damn. Somebody. That you was in a connection with is in love. This is somebody that walked away from you. Page of Swords with the Will of Fortune. Five of Cups. I can't make it up. Ten of Cups. They with the Knight of Cups. Five of Pentacles. They walked away from their happiness. They walked away from their happiness. Somebody caused their own coma. And now all they could do is watch you and stalk you. See you standing in your truth. Setting up boundaries. Six of Pentacles. Replaying all these old memories about this earth angel. How much you love yourself, how strong you are, how, how protected you are. Who chap? High priestess in the four of wands. 
Your stability, your stability, your level up. Mm. Give me one more card, Holy Spirit. Page of Pentacles. Somebody is stressed out because they want to. They want. They want to bring you an offer. They ain't got much, but they want to bring you whatever little that they have. But they're in their head. Okay, somebody. Somebody has a secret. Ooh, excuse me. That's a spirit bird. That's confirmation. Somebody has a stinky, disgusting secret with the Eight of Swords and the Moon card. Ten of Pentacles, Page of Cups. Make sure somebody is not coming back in because of your abundance. Three of Pentacles, Nine of Swords. It's not going to work for them. It's not going to work for them. Yeah, Ace of Wands with the Sun card. Three of Wands. I see you turning your back and going towards your brand new beginning. Mm. Let me get you guys some angel messages before we close this out, Sun Seeds. Yeah, Archangel Michael is here. I want to pull for the Moonology as well, Sun Seeds. Oh, I know this reading a little long, but listen, that's just Spirit tell me to stop, that's when I stop. Look, a win-win outcome is on a forecast. Either way you win. Spirit is saying, don't let your past hold you back. Whoever this person is that's coming in, hold your vision. Okay? If there's a vision that you, my nose itching. There's a vision that you guys have in your brain that you, you're ready to bring to fruition. Hold that vision. Focus on that vision. Okay? Mm, communication is the key. I feel like this person is, whoever this person that wants to communicate with you, I feel like they hold back because somebody is embarrassed about everything that they, they've been through. They're embarrassed. Give me one, one more card, Holy Spirit. Because this is how you showing up. This is how you showing up. Official person. Give me one, give me one Holy Spirit. The energy is gaining momentum. A fairy climax approaches. A personal issue reaches resolution. It's, it's, you're on the good side of karma. Whatever you was worrying about, full moon in Cancer, full moon in Aries, okay? Whatever you was worrying about, full moon in Libra, whatever you was worrying about, whatever that was stressing you out, Whatever that was tagging at your energy, trying to hold you back, your past is your past. I'm talking to someone who 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 doesn't who is moving forward with their life. They're not whining, they're not going back and forth, they are moving forward with their life. Somebody is not trying to help somebody who has created their own karma. The answers you need are coming, okay? Archangel Michael is letting you know that he's here. Somebody has something that needs to go in a book. Look at this. Archangel, look. You know what, spirit? I'm telling you. Earth Angel and Archangel Michael. <laughs> too light and too, too much protection. Too much. Gotta be careful how you treat people. You gotta be careful. You gotta be careful. Spirit is saying, pay attention to your thoughts, your career, um, your finances. Because what you think is what manifests. What you what you give energy to is what manifests. Make sure you are constantly thinking positive. And I'm, I'm not saying that it's going gonna, it's gonna to be easy for you to always, always think positive. But make sure when you, when you feel like a negative thought is trying to creep up, you block it. You block it. Okay? And you make sure you hit it with a positive affirmation. You ain't letting nothing grow in, grow in your nothing letting nothing grow in your dome. Nothing. And shield yourself. Shield yourself, throat chakra. Okay? Somebody who's coming in that's gonna bring you some type of communication or wanna speak to you. Spirit is saying you need to shield yourself from this person. Holy Spirit, give me some more. Oh, this is what you will be doing. Thank you, Holy Spirit. You all have free will, okay? Just make sure you're using discernment. And it looks like a lot of you guys here who I'm chatting for has good discernment. Um, with this throw shock and shield yourself, a lot of you guys um, are going to be shielding yourself from this energy who wants to, you know, talk to you. This could be text messages, emails. Somebody is trying to heal a situation from you. Let's, let's 
hella situation with you. Somebody sees you as a star. Yeah, books. Something about a book. Something needs to. So you guys can be authors, or be. Um, you guys can be in the process of publishing a book as we speak. But it's something. Yeah, clear yourself. Somebody got a lot going on. Yeah, because you are indigo theories. Very in. <sighs> Somebody is so chosen. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Yeah, I can't make it up. Visualize success. Mm. Visualize success, you heard that horn? Whatever pathway you on, this is where you at. This is where you headed. Be mindful. I love